in two days, we're realizing our dream of becoming medical professionals. We have the task of taking care of and healing our community. But today, we're becoming military officers. We take on the even greater calling of defending this great nation that we're so proud to represent and caring for those who will be standing by our sides in the military. I want to congratulate all of the students that are being commissioned today. We're extraordinarily proud of each and every one of you for your choice in entering the military. We are extraordinarily grateful for your service and we cannot thank you enough as citizens, not just as a dean or president of EVMS, but as a citizen for your dedication. You've entered the most noble profession, in my view, in medicine. And now you have one of the most noble missions within medicine itself. As a retired Army Colonel, I always look forward to meeting young people who will share the military medical experience and carry on the torch. With graduation and entering into military service, you are starting a new and different path. The connections you make in the military healthcare, the clinical practice that you'll have, the leadership opportunities, and the worldwide experiences will make you a better doctor. This may be the start of an incredibly rewarding career in the military, or a great starting point for a very fulfilling civilian career. Thank you and congratulations.